have a uh, crap block. So this motor came out of the junkyard from a uh, Odyssey, a wrecked Odyssey. And my guess is at the moment of the impact, it got cracked on the mount side where the water pump cavity is. So we're gonna try to fix it. And I was doing my research. I think the best option we get, or I got, is uh, using a spool gun. So we're gonna try that. And uh, the whole idea is gonna be making it structurally stronger uh, with the well, and then just gonna epoxy everything around. And hopefully that will hold. And then we get to keep working on this thing. It should be running once I get that fixed. And then we can start tuning on the fuel tank. So, let's see. That's where the crack goes down. Oh, it's pretty bad. It's at the bottom. Okay, so it comes back in. And after I weld it, I'm gonna clean all the inside where the crack is and JV weld it. Okay, so this is a spool gun. I never used one before. And I was doing my research and this this was my best option to weld the aluminum cast. Uh that one is actually not mine, my friend let me borrow this setup. But let me tell you it works pretty damn good. I got the whole thing welded around. It's not pretty, but it's welded. And then you won't be able to see that anyway, so. All right, I'm done. You see the water pump seat came out pretty good. Came out pretty flat. Flat as a coat, uh, there's a slight step, but I think the silicone can take care of. And the epoxy. Now I'm just gonna let it cure for a couple more hours and start putting it all back together. A few hours later. Okay, let's give it another try. All right, so we're full. We're halfway on this one. She'll be doing the, the bleeding work pretty much. And we'll see, hopefully we don't have any more leaks. Okay, it's been sitting for a few hours now, no signs of any water leaking, which is good. Uh, see some down there, but that was already there from when it was leaking. Okay, all of this is dry. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're ready to go. Okay, so I put it all back together. The only thing I'm missing right now is the intake. But I want to test the injectors before I put it on. Make sure they're working. And uh, there's one cool thing about fuel tech. Uh, you can test them right here. Pretty sweet.
Yeah, we got it fixed, bro. So, uh, crack is fixed. It's not leaking. I ran for a little while. Everything seems fine. So, now I'm just going to do some tuning on and And after that, I'm going to slap the intercooler, uh, piping, and uh, start tuning on some boost. And it should be done by next month when they open the track and they do the first test and tune. So, I'm going to be doing some videos on the fuel tech. Uh, so you guys stay tuned, maybe you catch some that is helpful for you. So I'll see you guys on the next one.